So the advantages are cheap, light, simple. Yep. Um, the disadvantages are uh, all those geometric ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't. We have camber uh, negative camber loss under compression. So as the car is leaning over, uh, the way that you would want the tire to contact the ground that you kind of set it up statically is kind of a moving target. Mm -hmm. So as it loads up, the car is going to need, you're going to need to check tire temps. You're going to have to check tire wear, actually have a, a driver that knows something to be able to give meaningful feedback about the G loads that the car is, is making to really kind of set it up and, and reasonably well. And one thing, you know, like even the Porsche, when you have a track line and a lot of negative camber, mm -hmm. I mean, it works good for your fast sweeping turns. Right. But then if you have like an autocross kind of turn, right. you can actually get into that tilt. So, you know, you turn in, it's awesome. And then the car just skates forward. Right. Or if, if you, you just a, pulled all the tire up off the ground. Right. Yeah. Or if you get a really ham-fisted guy driving, he, he could possibly do that too. Just... Yeah. 